Paulus says resident safety should be a key priority for the town management and for its business fraternity, including being open to render assistance in the event of tragedy. Paulus says he is ready to build more pedestrian bridges where needed at the town if assisted by the local business community. I want to put up a bridge here. Doesn't matter what it costs, so that the people can walk freely. Every time when it's raining, morning time, the people, they are late at work, they stand here. They cannot go home, they cannot. And I decided to build this uh, bridge for the people to pass. Municipality just asked me, so long I did it strongly, I don't have a problem with it. The person who assists us with some materials, must, Mr. Dio Shikulo, is the one who brings the material for 1,200. It costs us more than uh, 22,000. So we did it from the bottom of heart, me and my family. So that's why we did just for the community. On his part, the deputy town engineer, Timothy Gita, says he's overwhelmed by the initiative and the standard of work done for a sole purpose of saving lives. It needs to be structurally sound. Let's get it all. Let's go and look for examples that have been made and then use that as a template of what we can build here. As we're standing on this bridge here, it's been used quite a couple of times. It's sound. It's very sound. The pedestrian bridge was completed in three working days and is valued at $22,000.